So you're responsible for the uh, the modular machines, standard modular machines here at EMAG. You know, how are things going? Oh, things are going pretty well, thank you. So we have uh, now sold around about 600 machines per year worldwide, only with the standard machines. So uh, what is new? What, what's new about this machine tool? Uh, this machine is our, our youngest product, which is the VL1 twin machine. You can see it here in a configuration of two machines, making producing the part in OP10, OP20, mm -hmm. always twice. We have a twin spindle concept with high product tip out that. Yeah. So a lot of people think of EMAG maybe like a project-based company and long lead times, but that's not necessarily true with this product, is it? With this product, not. Uh, you're right that EMAG is a productivity company with the technology things and things like that. Okay, we do that in our customized sector, but here with the standard machines, we can give really short delivery time because we are pre producing the machines, not waiting for an order for customers, but our production line is made that we have the individual models being pre-produced in the company. Uh, just because they're standard modular machines, that doesn't mean there's a, a, a change in build quality, it's still the, the quality we would expect from EMAC. Well, this is the, the well-known and expected EMAC quality with all of the machines. So if we talk about the machines behind us, what, what features on this machine, what, why are they so popular? Uh, the main features of all these standard machines is that we have a very stiff bed frame uh, on the back side of the machine and we have a real modular concept which can be scaled for the individual um, product sizes starting from in that case 75 mil dia up to 400 mil dia. Uh, all the machines are look alike and are still built with the same concept. In that individual case we have a twin spindle concept so that the product two of the identical products will be turned in that way it's only a turning machine at the same time which means double the output on a for only one machine one footprint see it like that it's only four square meters mm -hmm. plus let's say what you need as supplementaries like chip conveyors and uh, cooling bins and things like that. And there's large advantages of mounting the component that way up, because obviously it's swarfed, it drops, it drops to the floor. Yes, this is the main, the main feature of all of our pickup vertical spindle machines, that all the chips are going just right away down to the chip conveyor. Mm -hmm. And how about the CNC control? How, what is it and how easy is, how easy is it to program? Uh, we are working with two different CNC controls. We have, uh, in that case, we, have a, we, are, we are working with a FANUC control, a 31i. Uh, and if customer is more, let's say, has a more better feeling with a Siemens control, he will get an 840D solution line. So both well-known controls, easy, easy to use? FANUC. FANUC. Almost for new. It's easy to maintain, it's easy to start, it's easy to set up. So just finally to conclude, it's a stock machine, it's a high performance twin spindle machine, yep. and you've still got the rigidity of all the other machines. Of all the other machines. Oh. I can say it's only the, the high productive thing and when the customer will decide for an EMAC machine, he will get high quality on his product. Uh, it will have a price, let's say, a, a good price worthy uh, production set and together with EMAC we, he, he can be successful.